Good morning. It is, oh my god, I don't know what day it is. I think it's Friday, the 29th. It's like eight something in the morning. I just woke up. I'm gonna be 100% honest. I really did not sleep well at all last night. I just don't wanna like lay in bed any longer. So I'm gonna get up. I wanted to show you guys my morning routine. I know that I've been talking about it a lot on Instagram lately about how I love it and how it kind of just keeps me grounded and makes me feel like I have some sort of schedule. Oh, bedhead. Um, normally I would shower. I still might, but I'm thinking maybe I could do some dry shampoo and, you know, call it a day. So we're gonna give it a go. What an angle. Work it. This is literally the best I can do, so. I feel like I am really bad at applying dry shampoo and I don't know if that's humanly possible, but if it is, I'm, I'm it. I'm that. Okay, I'm gonna be honest. Um, it it didn't do anything. I I actually think it might have made it worse. <laughs> Isn't dry shampoo supposed to give you like volume? I feel like this just made it like stick to my head. So ignore all of that. First thing I'm doing in my morning routine is showering. I just showered. I did my skincare. That's why my face is so red. But I'm about to brush my teeth. But. <laughs> I bought this like a year ago and I honestly forgot about it. It's charcoal toothpaste and it was like this trend going around and I was like, I really want to try it just because it looks so weird. It's like looking through my boxes and I found it. So I've been using it and it's like the weirdest looking thing ever, but I wanted to show you guys. It's hard to put toothpaste on a toothbrush with one hand. Okay, we got that taken care of, but I did it. It's on there. <laughs> that looks so disgusting. I just attempted to dry my hair. Probably not gonna straighten it just because I'm trying to like limit the heat I use on it and I'm not going anywhere today. So I'm just gonna kind of let it do its thing. The first thing that I usually do before I go downstairs is take my supplements. I have all of my supplements. I have my 3D energy drinks on this dresser. So every morning before I go downstairs, just so I don't forget, because when I get downstairs, I think food, food. Obviously I have to take birth control. That's not a supplement, but it has to be taken every morning. I have my water right here, already ready to go. Next, I take my probiotics. So I take two um, different probiotics. The first one I take is just from CV Health, CVS, CV Health, oh my God. The first one I take is just from CVS. It is a feminine health probiotic, so it's kind of like a blend of the probiotics that we as females especially need. And then on top of that, I also take acidophilus, um, I usually like the little capsules, but I got like these tablets instead and they're really difficult to, to get down. So I take those every single morning for feminine health. Next thing I take, Bomar Nutrition fish oil. I take one tablet a day. Fish oil has oil. Fish oil has been proven to help with heart health, actually mental health, reducing inflammation, bone health, joint health, brain health, eye health, skin, sleep. It just helps with a lot. <laughs> Last thing that I take supplement-wise, pill-wise in the morning is joint support as lifters, as people who are in the gym, as people who are picking up heavy things and putting them back down. It is very important that we maintain the health and integrity of our joints. So you're supposed to either take three at once 
or three spread out the day so like one with each meal i like to do it spread out the day just because these tablets are freaking huge and i just find it easier to like eat with my meals so that's how big they are and guys for some reason and it's not just me my mom said it too this smells like wine it literally smells like wine and i don't get it i don't understand I didn't have enough water with that one. Ugh. So I'm gonna head downstairs. I'm going to take the rest of my supplements, make my breakfast, and then I'm going to journal. But before I go down there, so I don't have to take both, I just wanna explain what is happening here. So this is my daily journal. Every morning I journal about something, whether it's three things that I'm grateful for, three things I'm manifesting, some things that are stressing me, what's holding me back. I actually journaled last night at like one in the morning because I was just so overwhelmed with like emotion about the current situation today. Just there's been a lot of bad things happening in the world and I just felt like I was feeling it all at once and I needed to like get it down on paper. I needed to get it out of my head and get it somewhere else. This one is a weekly journal slash monthly reflection kind of thing. So in a couple days, I will add to this and finish off the week and start to reflect on that. Before I even eat, before I even get a meal made, I, I'm holding this like there's something in it. This is <sighs> greens super 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 important part of my morning i am cheating a little bit and i'm using orange juice usually i use water and i mix them but today i'm feeling like i should treat myself so i'm using oj I also want to point out that I added some of um, my family's like red powder that they have here just because like why not so those are both in here the benefits guys think about the benefits think about it and then just do it Next up on the to-do list is to make my breakfast, which is every single morning a smoothie. I'm not a breakfast gal. Let me just sit and chat for a second. I hate eggs. And you're probably like, a fitspo doesn't eat eggs? Like what? No, I hate them. I, the taste and the texture just gross me out. And it's not just like one form of egg, it's all forms. I don't discriminate against my I guess I do discriminate against all eggs, but <laughs> I don't discriminate against my hatred of all eggs. Will I eat them? Yes, every once in a while I will. If I'm cutting and I don't have a lot of calories, I'm really hungry, I will make some egg whites. Do I like them? No. Do I sit there and like regret my decision every time? Yeah, so if you guys have a way for me to like, like eggs, that'd be great because I like making them. And I like the thought of eating them but your girl can't do it. So since I don't eat eggs and the only other breakfast options are really like very carb heavy pancakes, waffles. I could make like protein pancakes or waffles, but I don't really want that. I just make a protein smoothie because it tastes so good. So back with the OJ, cause I put it back and I forgot that I was making a smoothie. Such a random number, but I do 9.4 fluid ounces of OJ. Next thing, my favorite protein. I feel like I'm creepily obsessed with this flavor. Next thing I add is one scoop of the collagen. A serving size is two scoops, so 20 grams, I only use one. So collagen is just an all around great supplement. It helps with joints, tendons, cartilage, hair, skin, nails, like everything. Next thing is a banana. So I try to get 100 grams, but more or less is fine. Usually I just use one banana and then enter whatever I used. Last thing that I add is spinach. 
25 grams of spinach. So it's going to be a little loud outside because there are people working on our yard. I don't really know what they're working on. I just know that there's a lot of heavy machinery and I can actually show you guys right now. Oh. Hope you can see that. I don't know if you can. Oh, shoot. I think you could see that. So it's gonna be very loud outside. It's not really the ideal peacefulness that I'm hoping for, but I'm going outside. I have a glass of water, I have my journal, and I'm going to go sit down and just kind of reflect. I'm gonna to listen to some happy music. The Spotify playlist that I listen to is called Be Chill Morning. It looks like this. That is going to conclude this video. I am probably going to hit an upper body workout later, um, but I am going to post it on my Instagram so I don't want to overload you guys with the same content. Please let me know in the comments below what you want to see next. Please leave a comment regardless. I love reading what you guys have to say. Be sure to like this video and subscribe to my channel so you don't miss another video. And while you're at it, follow me on Instagram. I'll put the ad right here as always. Your support means the absolute world to me, guys. And I love you all so, so much. So until next time, guys.